What's up you guys? So I am on my way to go pick up my mom. I just left my house. We're about to go to this farmer's market. Um, I normally pick her up because she does my seasoning for my meat, uh, my rice. I put that thing on everything. So I just let her handle that because I've tried to do it myself and it just doesn't come out the same as your mama. So that's what I am doing. I'm heading to go pick her up so we can go to the farmer's market. And while we're there, we're gonna actually check out some prices, see if there's any empty shelves, uh, some shortages on certain things. So stay tuned. All right, you guys, so I just picked up my mom. Say hi, mom. Hi. <laughs> so we are on our way to the farmer's market. I, not on our way, we just got here. I just parked. So we're actually, and once you guys can see the farmer's market right here. My mom lives like five minutes away from the farmer's market. So very convenient for her to come and get some stuff. But we're gonna go inside. We're actually gonna check out some prices to see if there's any shortage in stuff. Um, but I really came in here to get my stuff for my seasoning because my mom does my seasoning, my sofrito. I need that because I can't do it, so my mom does it for me. It just tastes amazing when my mom does it. So we're gonna go in, so stay tuned. All right, so they have bags of apples, $4.99, $3.99. They're actually good prices. They bring a lot of apples in one bag see what else all right mom what are you getting what is this oh, all right so we need we got some tomatoes well she's getting that for her house um how much are these tomatoes mom they don't even have prices 129, Actually, 129 a pound so i normally don't shop in farmer's market is this a good price mom well sometimes it's good sometimes not Oh, I love this tomato. She loves these tomatoes, so she's gonna get it regardless of the price. <laughs> so, I don't know. You guys tell me in the comments is this a good price? $129 a pound. I normally get my tomatoes in Sam's Club uh, and they come in a bag. So, I just love coming to Farmer's Market because it's so freaking clean and so organized, always. Have all the fruits. All right. So the first thing we normally grab is the garlic. The garlic. You see how much it is now? Eight ninety nine for for one little container. It's a pound. It's very expensive now very pricey we actually used to get this for like maybe 3.99 for one little container it is now 8.99 in the farmer's market it's crazy but we're gonna get it because we actually need this for my sofrito all right what else Now we're getting some cilantro. My mom normally gets three packs of cilantro. How much is this, mom? Huh? How much is the cilantro? So it's a dollar, a dollar forty-nine. Now, did you? Is this the same price as before, or is no, it more expensive. more expensive? So the price has gone up on the cilantro. All right. Let's move it on up. Okay. All right, so now we're getting some green peppers. It's $2.49 a pound. Mom, is that price good or not? Has it gone up? Everything is going up. Everything is going up. Okay, she said everything is going up. So I remember this being a dollar something. It is now $2.49. So yes, it is definitely going up. Oh, 
And then next we're getting some red peppers. And the red peppers are more expensive. $3.99 a pound. So wow. More expensive. Alright, we're getting cilantro. Now this one is a different type of cilantro. This yeah. is actually two for a dollar, which is really good. What? The other one is culantro. Oh culantro. This is cilantro. Got it mixed up. But this is actually a good price, two for a dollar. So my mom normally takes four of this three packs of culantro we got some garlic we got some tomatoes some red peppers green peppers and we're gonna get some more stuff now we're getting some red onions my mom likes the red onions because they're a little bit sweeter than the white so a bag of onions is how much it's right here down there mom so $4.99 for a three pound bag. That's actually really good price. I love how clean and organized this is. Like, look at this. You don't really see this in a lot of uh, supermarkets. A lot of beans. Um, it's They don't have a lot of empty shelves. I've noticed that in a lot of farmer's market, they're always, they keep up and they always have a lot. Plenty of water. Look how organized and clean. I love this. This makes me happy. Just when I see very nice clean aisle. A couple of empty shelves. 609. Dag. Tomato and shrimp cocktail, spicy. That's a little pricey. Okay. All right, so my mom is getting some Hawaiian punch. They actually like drinking this at their house. I am not drinking that. I don't drink that stuff. But it is $3.79 for a gallon. Um, how much was this before, mom? Do you remember? $2.99. So they went up 79 cents. Do you need some Goya beans? No Goya? No, oh. Okay, a couple of empty shelves here for the bread. Uh, don't know what type of bread that is, but it's $3.29. All right, so she is getting some Goya beans right now. $1.59. Is that a good price? $1.59? Mm -hmm. The beans you're taking? The beans, oh. yeah. Okay. Well, she takes the big one. That one is actually $2.99. This is $1.59 for the small one. Plenty of hot sauce. Alright, so I normally buy these in Walmart for a dollar forty-nine and they're actually in the farmer's market for a dollar ninety-nine. So definitely a little bit more expensive yeah. here. Yeah. Plenty of vinegar. Alright, so we are in the Goya aisle. We love some Goya. So, what did you get, Mom? We got Sasong. So, how much is this one? 
Where'd you get this one? All right, so a dollar fifty nine. For how many packages? So eight little packages for a dollar fifty nine. That's actually a really good deal. Walmart, they're a little bit more expensive. What else do we need over here? We need oregano. Oregano. So where would that be? Yeah. It's probably a different brand too. A minute. So I just peeped this. This is nine forty nine for this little thing of garlic. That is very expensive. Yeah. So what my mom needs is the oregano. So she's getting this one. This one is four eighty nine. I guess that's a good price. Mom, that's a good price. Four eighty nine. No, it's, it's not a good price. <laughs> oh, four eighty nine. Yeah, four eighty nine no, for the oregano. That's that's okay, good. that's good. But the nine forty nine for the garlic, absolutely not. Way too too too, too expensive. Okay, a couple of empty shelves for the pasta. But other than that, pretty stocked up. All right, you guys. So in the farmer's market, you can literally find a little bit of everything in here. So they have plates. They have pots and pan over there. They got a broom. <laughs> Some Tupperware. Oh wow, some big containers for something, I don't know. They even have comforters and blankets. All right, so I'm recording everything I'm purchasing. Let's see how much it comes up to. Okay, so everything came out to $42.78, which is not bad. All right, so we are all done. We are leaving the farmer's market. Got all the ingredients I need for my sofrito for like $42. I'm good for two to three months for my sofrito, so don't have to come back for another three months. All right, you guys, so we are all done. Put everything in my car. All right, you guys, so we just got back home from the farmer's market. We are done. My mom is about to do my sofrito so I can be a happy child. Uh, but you guys, I hope you guys enjoy the video. Like and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Say bye, mom. Bye.